good morning student we have completed the first term i hope you all are completed the exam very well today class i am going to teach about the second term the first class the name is fraction the first class the name is fraction f r a c t i o n s fraction a fraction means uh, represent a part of whole number or a more generally any number of equal parts okay a fraction simply that as you have many parts of whole we have you have recognized the fraction the slash by this slash that it is written by between two numbers we have top number is called the numerator and the bottom number the denominator top number is called the numerator bottom number is denominator look at the example fraction is 1 by 7 1 is called the top of the number is called the numerator bottom of the number 7 is called the denominator okay uh, type of fractions here proper and improper fractions proper fractions the numerator is smaller than the denominator the numerator is smaller than the denominator that is called the proper fraction here look at the example 1 by 4 here numerator is smaller than the denominator isn't it so here four parts will be there here do you know that whole has be cut into the four parts you are required to take out one part if it is possible yes if it is a possible so it is a proper fra fraction proper fraction the numerator is smaller than the denominator is called the proper fraction then improper fraction the numerator is bigger than the denominator numerator is bigger than the denominator look at the example 4 by 3 4 by 3 here numerator is the bigger the denominator is the smallest so here 4 by 3 here 3 and 3 parts here only you have shaded the four parts only 1 2 3 4 so that was 4 by 3 that is the improper fraction proper fraction means numerator is smaller than the denominator improper fraction means numerator is bigger than the denominator mixed numbers are mixed fractions mixed numbers are mixed fractions a mixed number is a whole number and fraction combined together whole number fraction it is combined together is known as this mixed numbers okay now look at the example 4 and 1 by 3 4 and 1 by 3 here 4 is the whole number 4 is the whole number 1 by 3 is the fractions so whole number and fractions combined together is known as mixed number okay then converting mixed number to improper fra fractions mixed number a convert edukku improper fraction a convert pannanum okay now look first example 2 and 3 by 4 2 and 3 by 4 uh, first step multiply by the whole number here whole number 2 then denominate by the denominator yes 4 so 2 fours are 8 then add the numerator here comes 8 plus 3 yes 11 therefore 2 and 3 by 4 is equal to 11 by 4 comes to denominator here 4 okay look at the second example 5 and 2 by 3 5 and 2 by 3 first step uh, yes multiply by the whole number and denominator 5 3 are s yes, 15 then add the numerator 15 plus 2 s yes, 17 so therefore 5 and 2 by 3 is equal to s yes, 17 by 3 dear children this was homework first one 3 and 1 by 7 second one 1 and 5 by 8 third one 8 and 3 by 5 this three sums also it converting mixed numbers to the improper fractions that is the mixed numbers so you can convert into the improper fraction converting improper fraction to mixed numbers improper fraction to mixed numbers here improper fraction will be there just you have convert to the mixed numbers okay first you have divided the numerator by the denominator numerator by the denominator here 3 by 2 will be there so you can divide it 3 by 2 1 2 is 2 3 minus 2 yes we get 
answer 1 here 1 is comes to quotient here 1 comes to remainder uh, then second step uh, for quotient uh, write the quotient as the whole numbers whole number part and remainder is the numerator over the quotient as the denominator so first you have write the whole part of quotient as yes, 1 and remainder as well as the denominator as yes, 1 by 2 so for 3 by 2 is equal to 1 and 1 by 2 now look at the second sum 17 by 5 Denom first you have divided the numerator divided by denominator divided by the denominator okay 17 by 5 3 5s are yes 15 so 17 minus 15 we get the answer 2 here comes 3 is a quotient 2 is the uh, remainder 17 by 5 is equal to first you have write the quotient part of whole numbers here comes 3 and write the remainder and denominator 2 by 5 3 and 2 by 5 3 and 2 by 5 okay which is then this is home of 5 by 4 second one 11 by thir 3 third one 9 by 4 this is then write a proper fraction improper fractions mixed numbers converting mixed number to improper fractions and converting improper fraction to mixed numbers write a max note and do the homeworks also in your max note thank you children